Park, Arima is celebrating 134 years as a borough. And as part of this commemoration, tribute was paid to one of the most prolific sons of Arima, the Grand Master of Calypso, Lord Kitchener. Here's more from Ayana Carter. 11-time Road March winner, founder of the Calypso Review Tent, among many other accolades. Aldwin Roberts, known as Lord Kitchener, left Trinidad and Tobago and the world with truly memorable hits, such as Pan in A Minor, Trouble in Arima, Bee's Melody and Toko Band. Deputy Mayor of Arima, Herman Noel, said paying tribute to the Grand Master of Calypso was fitting as the borough celebrates another milestone. You know, as a young guy growing up, all you hear was Kitchener and Sparrow, right? And you know, now that he has gone and we are celebrating our 134th year as a borough and knowing that Kitch was a son of the soil, we feel it was the best thing to show some type of appreciation. Member of Parliament for Arima, Penelope Beckles, said we must make the effort to ensure that Kitchener's legacy and gift for storytelling lives on through young people. What Kitchener did for Arima is to put Arima on the map. And, and so when you think of Calypso, you think of Kitchener. When you think of Arima, you think of Kitchener and vice versa. Mayor of Arima, Kajni Casimir, said legends like the Lord Kitchener and the impact his contributions still have on the art form will always remain a part of our cultural DNA. I have no fear about the Calypso and the art form and about people singing the art form. I think our young people will catch on and they'll recognize how wonderful it is and it tells a good story. It's in us. It's in our, it's in our beat, on our movement and it's in us as a people. So culture is us and we are culture. Ayala Carter, TTT News.